and welcome to episode 2 of Kvyat, well not episode 2, technically episode 1, but the other one was an intro, we'll gloss over that later, but episode 1 of Daniel Kvyat's Revenge, and I've made a new calendar, it's not your average calendar, starting off in Bahrain, ending in Spain, and that rhymes, and I am off on our first lap, and I have messed up because I am not listening or concentrating as we head into turn one, late on the brakes, of have gone too late, probably, or oh, as we absolutely ride that curb, like, oh, I haven't got the AR on Legend still, have I? Uh, I have. Well, I'll be back in a minute. So we are back here trying to wait for it, well, nice English, waiting for it to load and we will go into one shot qualifying on master difficulty, not legend, because I am not a legend, I am a master of this game. And come on, load faster, please load faster. Come on, I haven't got all day, there we go, skip this, shut up Crofty, here we go. First lap, present first bit didn't happen, but here we go, concentrating this time. Here we go on our, oh, I've said here we go, well two more, I'll stop saying that. As we come down, not in even close to I'm, I'm, I've lost track of where we are. Into turn one we go. Lace on the brakes. This time we know it's on the right difficulty, and I'll probably end up starting last because I am a master of this game. But I've got no set up on, and that sun is very blinding. I'm sure if we do this in the nice. But here we are in Kvyat's car. Into turn. Oh, we're up into P12. This is a good lap so far. Hamilton currently on pole position, Kvyat up, oh Rosberg take pole position, it's like a good old Mercedes battle, we'll probably run each other off the road, but I am rambling, I am good at rambling, as, well, Kvyat's revenge, as I've said before, was finishing in Canada, where, not Canada, Spain, where Verstappen got his famous first career win and became the youngest ever F1 winner, as I forget to open the DRS there, and well, Daniel Kvyat's opinions on him. I'm not a fan of him. My favourite Vettel driver is Vettel. That probably is self-explanatory why I'm not a fan of him, but he's a nice guy. He's just out of his depth in, wa in, in water. In racing, in Formula 1. He can be good when he wants to be, but most of the time he's just torpedoing people. As I, I shouldn't talk and do qualifying laps. It just doesn't work. So, <clears throat> into the final corner we go going to start P16, probably even lower down now as I mess that up. Rosberg is going to take pole position for the first race of Kvyat season and P18. That's bad. Bad by my standards as well. That's very bad. But we'll make it up into the race by dive bombing absolutely everyone into turn one and oh, I forgot. If you're new to this series, the whole point is, in the race, we have to take out Max Verstappen as soon as we can and then try and guess as high up the field as we can. All we need to do is make sure Verstappen doesn't finish the race, basically. And I'm not a Verstappen fan either, so um, I like the series a lot. Three lap race, master difficulty, no formation lap. Here we go at Bahrain, five red lights. And away we go for the Bahrainian Grand Prix, and that makes no sense. And we are off to a phenomenal start, heading down into turn one. We go E I E I O oh, O. Oh, where's the stappen? Oh, there he is. Go. He is not finishing this race. If it is the last thing I do, that didn't happen. We'll just replay it. Into turn one, we go E I E I O. Oh. Warning, a collision is not enough. We can't have him finish the race. Come on, captures, captures, he's catching. Lift off a bit. In the wall he goes. If he's still in this race, is he still in? Don't tell me that didn't take him out. Did that not take him out? I'm having a giraffe. This is very professional, by the way, isn't it? How wasn't he taken out? This is rubbish.
Oh, for God's sake. This stupid game, I'm restarting this race. Right, restart. This is a very professional series, isn't it? And just restarting every minute. Right, here we go. Five, red light, no restarts from now. Red lights, that's the Bahrainian Grand Prix. How long did they want to take to go, but it lights out and away we go. And we get off to another phenomenal start. You would think it's into rigs, but it probably, it probably is, isn't it? Into turn one we go, EI, EI, over is Max Verstappen as we absolutely spin it around there. And Verstappen's got away. I lied, we're restarting. <clears throat> so, it's all going well. I want to keep this video under 15 minutes as Lance's over at my laptop and I've got to do it this time if I want to keep it under 15 minutes. It's lights out and away we go, we get so off to a dismal start. And I just need to dive bomb absolutely everyone into turn one. As I, oh my god, I should stop that absolutely rambling. Into turn one we go. Where's Verstappen? Oh, he's got away. For God's sake. Oh! For God's sake, I'm, I'm restarting. I'll edit bits out. <laughs> right, here we go. Final restart. No more after this. Five red lights at the Bahrainian Grand Prix. And away we go, and we get off to a flying saucer's veil line practically turns into Cape and Magnuson there. Into turn one, we go. Who will be last on the brakes? Probably me, as we are aiming for Max Verstappen. If we just miss him, we get... Oh, sorry, Vessel. Very sorry about that, Seb. As everyone's getting held up like a right mishmash here, and this is my time to pounce on Verstappen. Here we go, into whatever turn this is. Is he out? Please say he's out. That'll do. That will do. Hopefully he just gets disqualified, as we have not got a front wing. Can we finish the race without a front wing? Well, if he doesn't score points, it's the same as not finishing, so... We can finish without a front wing. Shut up, Jeff. I don't care about a three-second penalty. It's worth it for taking out the staff. If I just hold everyone up and make sure... We're not going to get points, but it's still fun taking out Max Verstappen. Maybe we can take out Nico Hulkenberg, Perez, while we're at it. Oh, break. There we go. Lovely jubbly. As, can we keep it outside, Perez? Come on, down the inside we go with no front wing. We mess up big time. Probably why I've got no Veneering disqualification. <laughs> this is going well. This is going great. They are not happy with my driving, ploughing Verstappen, ploughing Sergio Perez. And Rosberg puts in the fastest lap, as he would, as this is lap one, to be pissed. It's not worth pissing, no. Going to finish a race without a front wing, we've got Fernando Alonso, the legend, behind us, as he's getting overtaken by Felipe Massa in his McLaren Honda. Why did I do that in American accents as we hit Perez? And why am I singing? I don't know, but we're still in the points. Maybe, maybe P10 will be without. With, with, I can't speak English today. We're outside of that three-second gap, so we can get some points and finish ahead in the championship of good old Max Verstappen. And but he'll be crying to Red Bull now, saying, "Oh, get Max, Max, get Daniel out of the car. He is awful." And then Christian Horner will be like, yeah, sure. Because, you know, they don't like the ass at Toro Rosso and Red Bull. And they really don't like signs after his recent comments to the press. As Well, back to the race. We're in P8, lap two, one lap to go. We've got Felipe Massa and Fernando Alonso right behind us. As this, yeah, this video is going to be under 10 minutes, thank God. Because the last thing as I want is it to be over 10 minutes. Because that just doesn't look good. And, well, not long to go, I need to break. That's, we're, we're still in the points. Nico Hulkenberg behind, we can just take him out, because nobody likes Nico Hulkenberg. It's just that overrated driver, which isn't very good. A bit like me, I hype myself up for AOR, and then do also rubbish. Absolutely rubbish. Please go check out my AOR series, cheeky plug there. On to the main straight we go, not the main straight, the second main straight, that is a thing. On to the final lap, 
Um, and we've done our job. We... Why is our teammate in the pit? Carlos is in the pit. There's something that's happened at turn one, probably involving Carlos Sainz, the man himself, the man of the myth, the legend. Now we need to take care of Nico Fulkenberg if we want to get points. There's only one way to take care of Nico Fulkenberg, and that is making sure he doesn't finish the race. So, well, do we slow down or do we let him catch us? He's probably going to catch us anyway. We don't have a front wing. I just need to make sure I'm. Do I break check him? There he goes. He's got away. God save. We get a phenomenal exit there. And I'm just going to side swipe him. What's he doing moving in the breaking zone? It's a 10 second penalty that. Stupid Charlie Whiting. I get a 3 second penalty for taking out Max Verstappen. And then. I bet we can disqualify now. No. <laughs> so maybe I just won't risk getting disqualified. And I need to practice on taking out Max Verstappen to make sure I get away with no damage. But it's all gone well today. Max Verstappen. Shut up, Jeff. Max Verstappen is not getting points. We're not getting points. We're all happy if Carlos Sainz isn't getting points. Hopefully Ricardo isn't getting points. No one driving a Red Bull related car is guessing points as are we gonna get beaten by Grosjean at the line. No, we are north into the pits we <laughs> Into the pits we crash. As we'll just replay that. No one will notice except for people who are watching. Which won't be many. So through the final corner we go. Will Roman Grosjean guess us? No he won't. I won't let him guess us. Break check. Break check him, and that did not work. 14th place. It's ahead of Max Verstappen. All is good. Mercedes win the race. Surprise, surprise. And Daniel Ricciardo is on the podium. Lovely Australian accent, mate. As well, it, it went well. Where did Verstappen finish? Verstappen finished P19, we beat him. In my opinion, perfect race. Don't know what track is up next, but thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, check out my. Oh, I've got an achievement. I didn't race with a weather scenario, but oh well. Check out my other videos, follow me on Twitter. Thank you for watching, and another achievement. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you for watching. Check out my Twitter. Adios.